dual diagnosis means there's two disorders present, and it's often a mental health diagnosis and a substance use disorder. Um, clinicians are taught anyway, uh, are as medical professionals, to always assume that the mental health symptoms are a result of the substance use until proven otherwise. In other words, if you have somebody coming in with a severe methamphetamine addiction, I don't know who or how anybody could accurately diagnose mental health issues when they're in that state. Same thing with alcohol and, and opioids. Like, you know, I don't know how anybody can be going about diagnosing depression and other issues while they're under the influence. And even long after the detox period, I mean, when you look at people in recovery, I mean, they could be an emotional um, wreck for a long time after the substances are gone. So you, I think as clinicians, you always want to make sure that you're seeing the whole picture. You know, today's treatment does focus on integrated treatment teams where they treat everything under on one roof. And in my experience, I think there's a lot of people that want to be quick to diagnose mental illness. And I'm not saying it doesn't exist. I mean, it does many times. But I also think it's overdiagnosed and misdiagnosed when, when looked at too soon before the person has a chance to detox. And even with family history, a lot of clinicians will be like, well, we go off the family history. It's like, well, you have the dysfunctional family that contributed to the addiction and you have the person living under that umbrella if you will for all those years and then finally discover drugs and alcohol well is it still mental illness or is it the inability to cope with the problem that looked like mental illness that led to substance use which will now go away when we get them into recovery so you got to look at it that way too everybody wants to hand out a pill everybody wants to get their little label in the dsm-5 so they could build a person's insurance it's like just relax let the people breathe let them let them get into therapy you know and the diagnosis will come if it's there but like we got to stop getting away from this instant they have this because they're doing this